you think there's a difference in today's leaders than in past generations or political leaders? I mean, you've been at this since the 1970s, almost half a century. You're no longer in public office, but you're so tied to all those positions you have. What kind of changed from when you started to where it is now? I mean, you just left Washington, D.C. roughly, so you're at the epicenter of it, really. You know, I think in terms of public service, probably not much has changed okay. other than the fact that when I started in 1985-86, mm -hmm. uh, precinct captains got jobs. Okay. In this day and age, and quickly thereafter in 86, one began to learn that you need professionals, mm -hmm. that government is a big business with a lot of responsibility, mm -hmm. whether you need engineers or you need IT people, or whether you need public finance folks, that the, the year of going by your local Democratic headquarters, in our case, mm -hmm. and getting the party to sign so that when you showed up at the personnel office yeah. at City Hall, you got a job, yeah. those days are gone. gone. It's much more professional now. And 90% and, and of the government stays in place mm -hmm. with the change of the leadership of the governor or the mayor or the president. Uh, having said that, I think the one real negative is, is, is the toxic atmosphere of politics these days. That was not the case when I ran for office. Um, and as a result, people say, would you do it again? Would you go back and run for mayor again, you know, if you were 34 years old? And, and I'm not so sure I would really? um, because of that toxic atmosphere and, and the, the, uh, the way politics has, is being played these days in take no prisoners, salt the earth, I mean, et sure. cetera. And I think that's unfortunate because every time a bum Mm -hmm. Well, uh, the way I always say it is every time a good person steps away mm -hmm. from running for public service, whether it's school board or council or state rep or, or mayor or governor, every time a good person steps back and says, I'm not going to deal with it, mm -hmm. six bums step in to say, well, I'll take that role. You right. know? And, and, and we have a lot of, we're still very fortunate in this community and in this state that an uh, awful lot of good folks continue to, mm -hmm. to run for office. Right. But it's tough. Mm -hmm. It's really, really tough. Mm -hmm.